Libra. Let's get this party started. I hope everyone out there is doing okay. I'm going to get some channeled messages. Wow. All right. You have someone who is just like off the rocker. They're off their rocker. They're off the rocking chair. Yeah. This person is uh, child, childish, petty, low vibrational, and they constantly blame others. Um, it also says he is loco, she is cray, you are better than that. So if anyone around you, whether this is family, friend, um, ex, strangers, don't don't, you know, don't accept other people's energy and, and the, what the crap they throw at you. And I don't mean like you have to fight back. That's not what I mean by accepting it. We get tired of having to constantly defend ourselves, right? It's about being in almost like in the knowing like, okay, I know I'm not wrong here. I know you're the one that has some issues going on. And maybe you're just, they're just trying to project, deflect. You know what I mean? Upon you, Libra, upon us. So it's just uh, up to us. Again, not about being the bigger person, but just almost learning psychology. Yep, bingo. On the money. You made it. Go have fun. You are rich. That's some good energy around you, Libra. Whoa, back at the bottom. I was right on the money with that whole channeled message. He is loco. She is cray. Childish, petty, low vibrational blames others. All right, let's get into the tarot. Happy July. I hope cancer season is treating everyone well. I hope the air is clear where you are. Knight of Pentacles here at the bottom. He's up in the mountains where the air looks alpine fresh and clear the initiate the full embarking on new endeavors libra here's this queen of wands what is she showing up for we're gonna shuffle her out of there now we have a king of swords a queen of wands and a king of swords Ooh, the three of swords are these people trying to break your heart? I'm hearing, unbreak my heart, say you love me again, undo that hurt you caused when he walked out the door. And Libra's like, look, I'm on this Knight of Pentacles journey. We're starting back with the Knight of Pentacles at the bottom, onward and upward. We're moving to that crisp, fresh, clean air. First card out for Libra. Yes, the star. Wow. Talk about moving up. The star. You're also discovering more about yourself, your own um, origins, I'm hearing. Heritage, origins, DNA. And also about your own astro birth chart, of course. But also healing. I heard master teacher. Becoming a master teacher. Knight of Wands at the bottom. I'm feeling like with the star, there's a lot of, of course, the star is very attractive to many. I 
I heard young and old, like younger than you people and older than you people. The Knight of Wands is, to me, between the ages of 20 and 40. That's that knight energy. Whereas the kings, the queens, they're more mature. The alchemist, major arcana after major arcana, the temperance in your lab, creating. I heard catch up. This isn't quite a word on the street. I'm just sort of picking up on the energies around you and giving you the messages, Libra. But I'm feeling like it's a game of like catch up. You're moving ahead. You're doing your own thing. You're transmuting energy. You're healing with the star and this alchemist. It's like you're, you can alchemize any situation. I just heard base metal to gold. You can turn base metal to gold. And you have your boundaries up. And people are very aware of this. It could be hard to reach you. Hard to reach you nowadays. I heard isolate before you elevate. I heard there's an isolation. More of an isolation period. Before the elevation. So it's like. God removing a few people before this elevation. One more card for Libra. What is the most prominent energy around Libra and what Libra needs to know at this time? Thank you, Libra, for being patient with me. I've missed you guys the past couple days. That's two cards. We're not taking them. Just one. Thank you. Nice. The Eight of Wands. You have won something fair and square. I think this is something that has to do with an opportunity. And I say you won something fair and square because the five of swords here is at the bottom. So here you are picking up the pieces. And you know what? Even though you won, you're left to pick up all the pieces still. You try to make everyone happy. It didn't work. These two other people have been defeated, Libra, by you. And um, there's some opportunities coming towards you here with the eight of wands most definitely let's keep it going what would the mystic martian oracle oh as soon as i picked up the deck it went dark hold on libra oh <laughs> Interesting. Oh, it's 1101. 1101 on the clock. 111. Your own um, personal evolution is what I just heard. 111 self. What would like to come through for Libra, please? What would like to come through? Message for Libra. Thank you. The pentagram. This is about protection, harmony, idealism. What's at the bottom? Air, our element, empathy, philosophy. There's those air balloons. And I'm hearing again. I, I always randomly hear this. Moving on up, moving on up. Moving on up. 
Finally got a piece of the pie. And I heard something in the sky moving up to... I heard penthouse in the sky. I heard you're meant to show others how it's done. Once you reach your fulfillment, especially, um, financial fulfillment, and you can show others how to reach their own financial freedom, right? Kind of share your, your tips, your tricks. That is for some of you. What else for Libra? Vegans. Right now you're probably craving solitude, independence, and peace. And that's okay. Get out there in nature. Also be wise about the food you are consuming. Or a Boris at the bottom. Infinity, eternal, past life. Something about, what about Libra's past life? What's coming into play here? What about Libra's past life? Strength, courage, bravery. That warrior energy. The Lyrans. With messages, curiosity, and signs. Crop circles. I was just talking about crop circles as we were passing through a state the other day. Because they had a bunch of different, like they had a bunch of cornfields. And they actually had like a little side um, building set up where it had like UFO attractions, crop circles, pictures. Like it was really interesting. We didn't stop. We just, I saw it passing through and I was like, oh my gosh, that looks kind of cool. <laughs> and now this card shows up. You're going to be shown... Your strength, courage, and bravery, Libra, in becoming your true self, okay? Stepping into your divine birthright, it took a lot of bravery, it took a lot of strength, it took a lot of endurance. Harmony and idealism with protection in the pentagram, I feel like you had this vision for yourself and for your life. And some people thought maybe you were naive or foolish, but no, it took a great deal of strength to get, to get where you are today and where you are going, Libra. And you're going to be receiving some very special messages about your past life. Signs. And I heard star signs. These messages could come from other other star signs, other zodiac signs. You have to kind of listen, listen out, be aware what's going on around you. I'm not saying like. Uh, eavesdrop like no I'm not saying that don't eavesdrop but just pay attention it's it gets pretty synchronistic it gets pretty matrixy out here in the matrix Libra you know I just want to pull one fairy oracle card for you before we close this reading out I hope you enjoyed this quick video I missed you guys a lot thank you for sticking with me through many different 
changes in life. We have divination, seeking out and finding answers. Riddle Fisher, number three, with shimmer at the bottom, confidence, charisma, glamour, allure, number 39. Let's see. Riddle Fisher. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. I can't make it up. I can't, can't, can't make it up, Libra. Listen, time to seek out the help of the fairy realm to find what is lost. Recovering lost memories, past life readings, and issues are coming to the surface. Going through the emotional waters that are deep and knowing it is safe to do so. Feeling your feelings and knowing their wisdom. Searching for an answer. Water divining. That's pretty wild because I'm by the water, the Great Lakes. Beautiful, big, big bodies of water. This is also about finding clues to quandaries. Just as you are searching for answers, a fairy is searching for your answers too. They love your puzzles and will find things and answers to pieces of information for you that will put the current jigsaw into a meaningful picture for you. Come at this time. Allow this fairy to go on the search. You may not find the answers you were looking for, but you will find what is right for you. Let's see. Shimmer. Libra. Okay, yes. I have received this card myself, but this is just giving us a heads up, Libra, okay? You will soon be spending time with others who lead you to believe that you are less than. Be aware that in order to counteract the egoic tendency to go into your own faults, that's so crazy. I talked about this in the very beginning of this reading. Spirits here, Libra, always. You may draw upon the fairy power of glamour and draw around you the cloak of enchantment. This will help you protect yourself from your own tendencies to submit to fear and sometimes not handle yourself as beautifully as you are able. The fairy power of glamour is yours to be called upon. It will change your appearance ever so slightly. You will become more beautiful. <laughs> They're going to want to turn out the lights. They're looking for... Libra, they're looking for. <laughs> Let's see. Oh boy, Libra. Oh, why is there have to be bugs attracted to the light so bad? See, bugs. That means something, Libra. Bugs attracted to your light so bad. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. This will help you protect yourself from your own tendencies to submit to fear and sometimes not handle yourself as beautifully as you are able. The fairy power of glamour is yours. You will be more beautiful. Your eyes will be larger and shine more and your skin will be dewy. You will carry your body with grace and honor. You will radiate warmth and respect for yourself and for others. When this power is upon you, all will be drawn to you. And the glamour will get you through many a tough meeting. It is a very 
It is very powerful for when we need to ask for something from those in perceived authority. Your fey appearance may also be emphasized when you call upon the glamour. And I'll show you, I'll tell you a little bit about that. Close your eyes for a moment and set yourself. Close your eyes for a moment and see yourself being sprinkled with fairy dust from head to toe and from within yourself. See this golden light awaken and radiate out. Stand tall and strong and walk with deliberation and care. Meet the glances of people fearlessly and with belief in your own power and warmth and worth. Be warm and be strong. When we do this, we come from a position of personal truth and strength. Rather than from a belief in our fatigue, know who you are and then bring that forth. That is the true powerful glamour. When you invoke this power, all who see you will stop, share with you their attention, their respect, and their time. It's so true. Others notice your, your light, your beauty. It shines through. Take a moment, Libra, especially my divine femme or my divine masculine does not matter. Let's take a moment because you are a light, beautiful light in this darkness. Close your eyes. See yourself. Ooh, my crown chakra is tingling already. See yourself being sprinkled with fairy dust from head to toe and from within yourself. See this golden light awaken and radiate out. My angels, fairies, most high, sprinkle, Libra, my Libra friends now and myself. This beautiful fairy dust. And just visualize this golden light emanating from the core of you, Libra. And bursting forth. And so it is. Ancestors of the future... And a new kind of family based on loving, equality, and honoring physically, spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. Some of you most definitely have, if you're not already in a relationship, a divine partnership, a divine relationship coming. You're figuring it out. You're figuring things out step by step, Libra. I just heard Rome wasn't built in a day, and we can't know everything all at once. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give me a big thumbs up. We will chat soon. I will read you later. Stay balanced. Stay blessed, Libra. Love you guys truly from the bottom of my heart chakra. All right. Peace.